We've seen an increasing interest in our customers looking at encryption as a service, and there's a lot of reasons for this. Primarily that having your data encrypted at rest, you might have a transparent data encryption layer under that, uh, Oracle, TDE as an example, but that doesn't protect you from risk vectors like someone uh, exercising SQL injection against your database or dumping out those tables. Anyone with an authenticated SQL client uh, in this example can see that data. So obviously having very sensitive data and wanting to encrypt those rows and columns becomes a focus. And Vault is an excellent tool to do just that. So what we've seen people doing is in the same way that AWS Key Vault or GCP Key Vault or Azure Key Vault works, um, you can get the same type of functionality with Vault and that you can take, your applications can take plain text, uh, swap it for ciphertext, have a very friendly API to do this, and then go and persist that data um, and, and potentially combine it with transparent data encryption. And some of the folks that we've been working on uh, to actually scale this out is, is large retail customers who are protecting um, their member rewards data, processing these batch transactions um, at, in bulk uh, across uh, Asia and now rolling out into North America. We have folks who are um, large risk and monitoring companies for fraud. And again, they, they have very sensitive requirements around PII, uh, making intelligent and, and timely actionable decisions when they detect uh, that their members might be at risk. And the volumes of these workloads, this isn't just you know a few, few hundred requests per second. Uh, we actually have these folks rolled out into production with a magnitude of, of 15,000 to 20,000 requests per second. So with rate limiting, that can be um, 2x potentially of, of what you might get from a cloud provider. And you can have a local replicated vault cluster serving those encryption keys uh, and doing that in a much more performant way for you. So we've actually worked with those folks to uh, drive new features with vault, especially performance standby nodes, where now that encryption workload can essentially be scaled um, horizontally across the vault cluster. And, and for our large gaming customers, that's become extremely important. We're looking at potentially 30 to 40 uh, in the longer term roadmap of, of global clusters deployed for vault. And again, they, they, they have data that is, that is very important to their, the, the folks that use their services, uh, protecting that around the microtransactions, credit cards uh, that they're actually using uh, to purchase things in game. So again, we're seeing a, a huge uptake in the interest for encryption as a service. Uh, we're continuing to make that feature easier to consume, to provide um, guidance in how folks are rolling it out. Um, and at the end of the day, it's exciting to see that people are having a lot of success um, and, and able to do it at, at scale. That's super impactful for the business.